there, and welcome to Storytime with Kay. Today we will read Inside Out, Box of Mixed Emotions by Brittany Kando with illustrations by Jared Maruyama. This book was published by Disney Press in 2015. Hi there, I'm Joy. I'm in charge of being, well, joyful. And let me tell you, there are a lot of things to be happy about. Like dinosaurs. And sprinkles on cupcakes. And monkeys. Ooh, and bouncy balls. You know what else is really great? Making goofy faces. And twirling. You just gotta twirl sometimes. Sunshine is my absolute favorite. Ooh, but rain is my favorite too. You know what else is cool? Shiny red bicycles. And new adventures are the best. But most of all, I've found that happiness is being with your friends and family. Um, Joy, I think you stepped on my foot. Sigh. Hi, I'm Sadness. I usually feel pretty blue. I just don't understand the world sometimes. Like, why does ice cream fall off the cone? Or why do pen pencils break? I like rain. It makes you shivery and droopy. Puppies can be cute, but then they chew on your new sweater. Things just move too fast nowadays. I always seem to lose something. Or I'm the one who's lost. I like crying. It helps me slow down and obsess over the weight of life's problems. And I feel better, but then I feel sad again. You have got to be kidding me. Hey, what are you looking at? Fine, I'll introduce myself. I'm Anger. You aren't going to get all touchy-feely now, are you? I hate it when people say weird things like, Don't have a cow. Why would I have a cow? What does that even mean? Don't lose your temper, they say. Well, don't worry, I haven't lost it. It's right here. I like to honk my way through the traffic jams of life. And I make sure we get our head on head in the game. I've perfected the art of stomping and glaring, just in case anyone tries to put us in time out. Time out? Yeah, I don't think so. But if there's one thing that burns me up, 
More than sunsets. More than scented candles. It's putting vegetables where they don't belong. Broccoli on pizza. You think I wouldn't notice? Ew, that is not food. I'm disgust. You should know there are a lot of gross things out there. Like feet. Who decided people should walk around on smelly blobs with toes sticking out the end? Even the things that cover feet are gross. P.U. While we're at it, crabs. What are they even doing crawling sideways like that? Or cows. I've got a disgusting word for you. Udders. Want to know a lame activity? Going on a 28-hour road trip in a tiny car. Let me tell you, nothing is worse than hearing the same sad song sung off-key over and over again by Dad while you're trapped in the car. Except maybe sleeping on the dirty ground. Or sweating. Ew, totally gross. Or not having any running water. I don't do smelly. Or a dangling spider. And you know where all of these awful things happen? Camping. In the woods. Where there are all sorts of hairy wild animals and strange little bugs that can hop on you at any moment. No thanks. I'm done. Sp sp spider huh, Hello, I'm fear. I consider every day we don't die a success. Especially since the world is full of terrifying things. Look, I have a list. There's the stairs to the basement and grandma's vacuum cleaner. And dare I even say it, clowns. It's my job to keep us safe from peril. Like making everyone aware that sliding down banisters is very dangerous business. But no one listens to me. We could lose a tooth or something. Is it worth it, people? It's a thankless job. Somebody's got to do it. But let me tell you what I like, what I do like. I like safety. I like being surrounded by soft things like feathers and marshmallows. Oh, and socks. And I love to relax in the evenings, sip a cup of tea, and watch a peaceful nature show. Ah. Aw, what a cute little hippo. The end.